Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Danganronpa V3. Alright. It's time to do it. It's time to do it. I'm just... Ugh. I just don't even know. I'm worried. Let's set all our things. I think that's all we had. And then that should hopefully be enough to start. Uh, and then we'll see where we can go with that. 14 out of 21. We could still purchase one more. Uh, but you know what? I'm not too worried about it. So that's what we're going to do. Let me just make sure they were set. Yeah, they are. Okay, we're good. Now, we've read everything. I I don't know how this is going to go. I might flub up a little bit. It's been a long time since I've played Danganronpa in timeline-wise. You know what I mean? Like, even through real time. I don't remember exactly how all this stuff works. And this one, I think, is probably going to be a little different. Let me just check my difficulty. Yeah, yeah, logic is normal, action is kind. That's perfect. Don't get mad at me. If maybe if I maybe if I get a feel for it in this trial and I feel good about it, I can change it in the next one. We'll see. Oh, deep breaths, deep breaths. Let's begin. Okay. Yup. I am ready. Here we go. It's in session. Oh, I, I'm so scared. Ahem. Now then, let's begin with the basic explanation of the class trial. Hey, he's starting to sound a little more normal. Did you notice? Just a little. It's getting there. It's getting there. Yes, please explain everything to me, because I'm an idiot. During the trial, you'll present your arguments for who the culprit is, and vote for who done it. Right, right. Vote correctly, and only the blackened will be punished. Right, right, right. But if you pick the wrong person... Kokichi gets punished. No? Damn it. I'll punish everyone besides the blackened, and that person will graduate from this academy. Okay, okay. Same, same. Also, refusing to vote will result in your death. Uh-huh. So you better vote for someone. Yeah, that's also the same, pretty much. Now let's get this crazy awesome, crazy awesome trial <laughs> underway. Oh, let's. So people told me that um, you want to be careful saving through here. Uh, I guess there's some kind of bug that exists that can wreck stuff. Um, I'm going to try to do my best to go as far as I can, hopefully to the break, and then if it's a very long video, which I assume it will be, um, I'll just split it up in the middle so the next trial won't have an introduction. You guys know how it goes. So We'll do our best. It's starting, huh? It's starting. Jesus Christ, Ganta is huge. <laughs> can we just say that real quick? <laughs> oh, man. I haven't been in a trial in, like, forever. Why have you even been to one period? You know, I gotta say something right away, though, looking at this. I love the design of this. Look, I love the little picture of his tiny little bit of face close up with his name. I really, really like this kind of aesthetic that they've got in here. Oh, so you have experience with trials? Yeah, yeah, really. <laughs> That's what yeah. I asked. <laughs> Since I'm a leader of evil and stuff, <laughs> I've done a lot of bad things. Like what? Wet your bed? So, oh, no. what are we supposed to do? Where do we even start? I don't know. I hope the game will guide me. Gonta never done trial before. Not sure where to begin. We'll figure it out, buddy. You and me, we're standing together. First, let's breathe in. Yeah. And breathe out. True. We need to remember our no no no's. Breathing in is and out is very good. I think that's the No useful. pushing, no running, no talking. Okay. Oh, we kind of have to talk. But communication is the foundation of any discussion. True. This is we so cute. Worry about our procedure, especially since this is not a normal trial. That's also very true. We just have to follow the rules that they put in place. Each of us will be serving as a potential culprit, lawyer, prosecutor, and jury member. Gosh, she's so sharp. I love her. Let us proceed with that in mind, shall we? I love her. That 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 means something terrible is going to happen to her. Then might I offer the first topic? You can offer anything you want. Go ahead. I can get ahead of us. You trying to start some shit? All right, Mio, I'm gonna have to shut you down here for a second. Okay. C calm down. How about we listen first? Yeah, yeah, we gotta listen to everybody, don't we? Atua has spoken. Whoa. He what was that noise? It is vital that we hear everyone's testimony. What was that? Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> what was that? I'm a good listener because my ears are clean. What? Once, I cleaned them so hard. They bled. Fascinating. Well, I'm glad the two children are in the corner together. I'll begin the conversation then. That makes it easier. There's something I found curious. What was that, darling? 
Why, I wonder, didn't the culprit take advantage of the first blood purge? Yeah, that's probably that's been on everyone's minds, I'm pretty sure, including ours. I thought that was strange too. Yeah, yeah. So let's talk about that. I bet they just wanted to do a class trial real bad. Really? Is that were you really? Is that what they wanted? Was it you? Then Monokuma's the culprit, the doi. Because this whole class trial was his idea. Oh god, is this class trial gonna be like every other class trial where their, their voices somehow get lower than what you wanted and the, the music is over them? Because they already sound, to me anyway, a little bit low, but I'll see what I can do about it. Oh yeah! Easy peasy! I'm a fucking genius! God, the aesthetic in here is killing me. It's great. Wait, is it even possible for Monokuma to be the culprit? God, it just looks great. I don't know if it's possible for Monokuma to be the culprit. Haven't we gone through this in the other two games too and it hasn't been up till this point? Of course not. Uh-huh. I would never do anything to you guys directly. Right, right. Even I'm gonna take a sip. you can't, it's a different story for the person controlling you, right? Oh, true. Maybe. Hmm? <laughs> Is it possible that the mastermind controlling Monokuma killed Rantaro? Oh. Asking Mastermind. the big questions right away. What's that? Oh, come on, don't even start. I don't know any mastermind. You got someone controlling you, boy. You've never heard of him. Uh-huh. Don't play dumb with me. Who's the mastermind controlling you guys? Get him, Kaede, yeah. Do it. Mastermind, huh? Odds are it's one of us. Yeah, but what if it what if this is the time where it's not? It's Keyblade over here. Everyone else thinks so too. Oh, stop. Oh, here we go. You're gonna start drama already. Does everyone really think that? No, don't you worry, sweet boy. It's fine. We'll get to the bottom of this. <laughs> okay, they just plain up mad, isn't she? <laughs> okay, you, you keep laughing. Before we determine the mastermind, we must uncover the culprit. Okay, I agree. Then... We could start by determining the sequence of events. Good job, Shuichi. Let's do that. Let's take a closer look at the circumstances of Rantaro's death. All right. Gonta agrees with Shuichi. After all, Shuichi is ultimate detective. Choo choo. I trust him too. Then let us start by reviewing the incident. All right, let's do it. All right, let's do this. We can find the mastermind if we work together. When the class trial is over, we'll know exactly who the mastermind is. And now, the class trial has begun. As things progress during each class trial, non-stop debates will occur. Oh, look at all this. Okay, it looks fairly similar. The influence gauge, the time on the bottom, the truth cylinder and the bullet, and the thing that the person's saying in front of you. So that at least, okay, this looks the same. During non-stop debate, characters will speak one after another without pause. It's up to you to unearth any lies or contradictions in their statements. You'll have to use the truth bullets you gathered to refute what they say. Any relevant truth bullets you found during the investigation will be loaded into the truth cylinder. Move the mouse to aim the reticle and left click to fire. Hopefully that works for us. Aim for the gold words displayed in their statements. Those are the weak spots. There's a chance that the lies or contradictions are hiding within those weak spots. But remember, you might not be able to refute them all, and you have to use the right truth bullet. Compare everyone's statements to the truth bullets you have, and shoot your truth bullet at the proper weak spot. Note that if you run out of time, you will automatically fail, so please be careful. Oh, I almost forgot. The new element. Uh-oh, here we go. I don't like learning new things. During the trial, you can concentrate using the space bar to make time slow down. Wait. You mean focus? Hasn't that always been a thing? This will also reveal a small red dot within weak spots called the V-point. Oh. If you hit that with the correct truth bullet, you'll get an awesome V-counter. Bullseye. Well, then I'll try to use it. V-counters really improve your score and the number of mana coins you earn, so try that out. During the non-stop debate, pressing the F3 keys will bring up the controls. Okay, F3, remind me, guys, because I'll forget. Give them a look. Can I do it right now? <laughs> it worked. All right, here we go. All right. Uh, like I said, it'll take me a couple seconds to finesse this and get, you know, used to it once more. 
Thank you, Tutorial Chan. You're the best. Okay, so let's see. Oh, God, this looks really good, doesn't it? Monokuma file, moving bookcase, Rontaro's belongings. Rontaro's okay. body was found. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Just before the time limit, right? Okay, I usually like to read my stuff horizontally. He was killed in the library. Oh, Jesus. Rantaro was alone in the library. Okay. The culprit could have snuck up on him. This is hard to read. What was he even doing in the library anyway? What was he doing in the library anyway? He was opening that moving bookcase for one reason. Right? Because he knew about the hidden door. Okay. That means Rantaro was masterminding this whole thing. That's obviously what I've got to press. But we've got to make sure we know. There's definitely a contradiction in one of those statements. If I present the right evidence, I can blow away the contradiction. I think I already know what it is, but I was just really gobsmacked at how weird this looks. But it looks so cool, too. It's very hard to read. Rantaro's body was found. Mm. Here we go. Just before the time limit, right? Rantaro did not have a key card on he him. He was killed in the library. I think that's what I'm going to use. Rantaro was alone in the library. Right, do we... Is it because sped up the same way? Snuck up on him. No. What was he even doing in the library anyway? No, it doesn't look like I can... Oh, okay. He was opening that moving bookcase for one reason. How do you... Maybe you can't speed it up yet, because this is the first the one. Door. That's probably what it is. That means Rantaro... Uh, hello? It wouldn't let me shoot. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Are we already... Are we already fucked with these controls? It wouldn't let me shoot it. Hang on. Let's try again. Sorry Rantaro's about this. body was found. <laughs> Just before the time I'm just gonna shoot right? off here to make sure it works. He was killed okay, it in does. The <laughs> just, I tried to shoot Kokichi in the head with it. It's fine, right? I was just practicing. What was he even doing in the library anyway? Oh my god. Oh, we're in trouble he was here. He's opening that moving bookcase for one reason. No, no, no. We'll get it. We'll get it. He knew about the hidden door. Yeah. That means reminding this whole thing. Counter. No, that's wrong. Yes. Look at that. Break! Oh, that looks cool. This looks so cool. Wait a minute. I don't think Rantaro was the mastermind. Well, you did, but we don't now. It's true. Huh? Why? Because he didn't. All he had on him was the same shit we all have. Because Rantaro didn't have the card key to open the hidden door. Well, it's possible he could have thrown it out. I agree with this. You'd think the mastermind would have that card key on him, right? Yep. Perhaps the culprit took the card key after killing Rantaro. I guess that is also possible, but... But none of the pictures show Rantaro holding the card key. Well, technically, it could have been in his pocket. But we can't get all Phoenix right on this, right? We have to go wherever the game leads us. So, I don't really think he had the key at all. Okay, so if Shuichi's saying he doesn't think that it was there, then we're just going to assume that it wasn't and not think too hard about this. Because that's how I get into trouble, is thinking too hard also, about these things. If the Mastermind had died there, this killing game would have already ended. True. Maybe. You are correct. Unless there's two. The possibility of him being the mastermind is quite low. Okay. So we're all going with that. Then how Rantaro know about Hidden Door? I mean, we knew about it too. We could have just found it. Maybe he stumbled across it in the library. Yeah. You know, like how Shuichi did? That's right. Or maybe the mastermind told him about it. Oh. Oh. What? Why would the mastermind tell him that? That's a possibility. To lure Rantaro to the library and kill him. Hmm. Okay. Does that mean the culprit and the mastermind are one and the same? Maybe. Hmm. That does seem plausible. Oh boy, okay. It's very likely the mastermind knew about Kaede and Shuichi's trap. Maybe. We weren't exactly subtle about it, were we? The Mastermind knew about our trap this whole time? Okay. This case may have become the perfect crime thanks to your hidden cameras. Uh-oh. Whoops. The Mastermind knew about your trap and exploited it to commit their crime. Okay, okay. I see what you're saying. So after the Mastermind lured Rantaro and murdered his ass... <laughs> They used Kai Idiot and Puichi's hidden <gasps> cameras to arrange the perfect crime. Oh, Puichi. Oh, bless. Did they really take advantage of our trap, though? Maybe. That's what everyone's putting forward. What are we going to do? Is this really the perfect crime? Are we in an unsolvable mystery? Oh, do you remember that show, Unsolved Mysteries? That was a good show, but it scared the well, shit out of me. This is a dead end. Don't watch that before you go to sleep. Wait, don't give up that easily. 
we already know the culprit is the mastermind. Uh, do we though? We gotta work together to find the mastermind. That's... Then we can end this killing so game. So this is where I'm worried. Do we know that? Because the card reader wasn't even used according to Shuichi. So do we know that that's what happened? I'm almost... My gut feeling is telling me no. You yap about teamwork and all that. But you still think one of us is the mastermind. Kokichi, I don't blame you for saying that, really. Yes. And I know that's a horrible thought. It is. What if you're wrong? But that's why I want to end all the terrible things happening to us. Guys, I don't feel good about this. I, I, I've got a bad feeling I'll already. I'll defeat the mastermind and end this dumb killing game. The way they're starting this off is wrong. Like, some, like it's not like one and two. It's different. I'll, I'll even use this class trial to do that. Okay, well, I hope I'm wrong about this. We're going to do it, Katie. We'll find the truth. All we have to do is find the truth. <laughs> wow. Looks like you're determined to face even a cold, hard truth. What does that mean? Oh, he's just messing here it with comes. us. The cold, hard truth. No, I don't want to see nothing you've got. Please, is that a euphemism? Because if it is, I'm shutting it down instantly. Because it's you. Huh? What have you got? I already figured out who killed Rantaro. Did you, Checkers? Well, why don't you help us all out and tell us? What? Oh, look, <laughs> Maku's sweating. Why are you surprised? Okay, if all Kokichi does is use his sass to fuck with Monokuma, then he'll be in my good graces. Cause if he's right, that would make this the fastest class trial to date! Oh, let's do it. Let's make the record. How fast was the previous record anyway? Who knows? Real fast, let me tell you. <laughs> yeah? He was like a leaf on the wind. Who in the world are they referring to? Oh, yeah! I guess now he's won with the win. Wait, what? Yeah, I think about him this time of year, too. Oh my god. The way he soared through the enemy fleet, oh, badass. Just to die like a little pug. Wait, who are they talking about? Shut it, you weirdos. This is an important conversation. It is. Kokichi, are you serious about knowing who the no. culprit is? No, he's he, No, I'm going to tell you right now, he's lying. Yep. So, we all agree I'm sipping, by that the, way. the culprit knew about Kaede and Shuichi's trap, right? Got my grapefruit LaCroix right here, ready. No shit! That's why they're not in any of the pictures. So who is it? All right, who is it then? So whoever knew about the hidden cameras is the culprit. Okay. So who the hell is it? Wait, what? what's happening? It's you! What? What? Oh, me you? Uh-oh, is he just wasting... Sometimes this happens when they just waste time. You made the cameras used for the trap, right? She did. Obviously, whoever made the cameras knew about the blind spots. Okay. Before breakfast was the only time someone would be able to sneak by. Okay. Wh what the hell brought this on all of a sudden? Mew, it wasn't you, I hope, was it? I, I just designed the cameras. I didn't know they'd get set up in the library. That is true. Kind of. If someone asked me to make cameras, I'd totally ask what they were for. Oh, would you? Well, I'll ask you next time. what the cameras were for, huh? Huh? <laughs> I, I, I pulled an all-nighter making them and afterward just sort of passed out. Oh, dear. You're getting awfully worked up. Look at you. You're sweating. Aw, uh, leave her alone. I'm always wet. Oh. I'm just feeling extra sensitive. What? Like these big boobs of mine. Whoa, okay, this is not the time for this. For someone so aggressive, you're kind of a wimp, huh, Mew? Uh, yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we've been new. Come on, let me up the hook already. D do you want money? Is that it? Pearl, like you've got money. Your Wait, do you? pathetic excuses are consistent with those of a common male criminal. Uh-oh, Tenko just wrecked! Oh, shit! Everyone's starting to suspect Miu, but... Is that really okay? No. Oh! <gasps> Tutorial Chan is back! From here on out, blue-colored weak spots will appear. If we call the weak spots you've seen up till now argue points, then these blue-colored weak spots will be called agree points. When shooting agree points with truth bullets, you need to flip your way of thinking. Right. 
instead of arguing that the other person's testimony contains lies or mistakes. Please fire the truth bullets that prove the other person's testimony is correct. When your truth bullets merge with their statement, they will com complement each other, resulting in a consent. Okay, so this is the same, pretty much. From now on, you must infer whether it's best to argue or agree based on what's being debated. Boy, they start you off with this immediately. You can also V consent, so if you're confident, give that a shot. Thank you for your time. Respectfully, system. Thank you, tutorial John. Alright, what have we got? Let's see. Now, normally what I do in these cases, in case you haven't seen anything before this... Why don't you this, just admit it already? It's just, I shoot them if You're I know the it's culprit, there. aren't you, Mew? But usually I have to go through it once. No way! That's not possible! Oh my god, this is difficult. Look at this. So you knew nothing about the trap in the library? Okay. I'm nothing telling so you, I had no idea! Okay. Not like it matters. Because I never went to the library, okay? She never went to the library. The person who made the cameras... What do we have? Would have known their blind spots too. Oh shoot! Wait, what's Karakio's account? Uh, during the body discovery announcement, Kyo, Miyu, Kurumi, and Sumugi were in the dining hall. By the way, thank you for telling me how to scroll this. You have to hold the right mouse button down and move the mouse up and down. I think it's a little bit weird. During the body discovery, Kyo, Miyu, Kurumi, and Sumugi were in the dining hall. Miyu was in the middle of building a remote control gadget, so she'd never gone. Smoogie had briefly gone to the bathroom and turned shortly after. Then that's probably yeah, it. Yeah, well, I didn't make the cameras either. No, you did do that, girl. Don't lie about that. Mia is so shaken up that she's starting to dig herself deeper with her own lies. I need to take her side. Rushing to judgment will only make things worse. Can we? Why don't you? Can we? Fast forward debate? Oh, it's escape. That is not where it was before. Oh, that's a, not a good... No. You just admit it that's already. That's not good for me. <laughs> You're the culprit, aren't you? Here we go. No, it's impossible. Okay. So you knew nothing about the trap in the library? I won't be able to use that until I'm, I'm confident. Telling you, I had no idea. Not like it matters. She never went there. Because I never went to the library. She's right. I agree with that. Yeah. Okay, here we go. We're getting it. Break. I don't think Mew went to the basement either. Right, Kyo? Yeah, yeah. Of course she didn't. Mew was in the dining hall during the murder. That's right, she has an alibi, so that's okay. I saw her there while dining on what I thought would be my last supper. Uh-huh. The pasta on the menu tastes like a oh, lonely this again. old lady eating her grandkids' birthday cake. Oh, Jesus. Don't what? feel bad for her. She got to eat her tasty grandkid on his birthday. Ew. What in the world? It's sad to make sense. It is. That's pops for you. <laughs> oh my god. So there you have it. Muse alibi. Great job, handsome. We did it. You fucking slug. Why didn't you say so earlier? Well, that's hardly a way to talk to someone who just saved your ass. Good job, Kaede. Guess I shouldn't have judged you by your lackluster rack. Madam, my shit is almost as big as yours, if not We're bigger. Gilgamesh level condescension. Whoa. But which grail war are you from? Her references are so funny. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow, another reference we don't get. <laughs> you must be a hardcore loser. Oh boy. Oh, sorry. Sometimes my hobbies just sort of slip in. That's what she said. Wait, what? Hey! Don't be acting all cocky, Kokichi. You put my ass in the hot seat earlier. True. Beat him up. Punch him. I thought you just keep your fucking mouth shut, you lying little abortion. Whoa. Okay. You know, that might be true, but you don't have to say it. What? Th that was really uncalled for. I only said that to find the culprit. Oh, c don't start crying now, checkers. You all right. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my. Hey, I feel a lot better yeah, now. Yeah, okay. <laughs> you just it's fine. Oh my Cooling god. Jets, kid. Seriously, what are we gonna do? Sumugi and Kirumi were both in the dining hall as well. Okay. So they have alibis too. We can dismiss those four as potential culprits if they were together the entire time. Right, right, okay. No, not the entire time. Oh, at one point, Sumugi went to the restaurant. Sumugi, did you do it? Come on, you're a typical nice girl, don't tell oh, me. So you brought that up after all. What happened? It's true. 
I went to the restroom closest to the dining hall. Okay. Oh? Did I hear that right? The restroom, you say? Excuse me, I had to sneeze. And don't you start. What'd you do? You interested in that? No. Excellent. I was waiting for this moment. We don't want to talk about I'm the restroom. I'm getting so excited right oh, now. Oh, no, you're into that. I know you are. We know. No. Why? <laughs> this face. Did you take a firm dump? Or oh. was it a soft one? We inquiring minds need to know. <laughs> oh, my God. Holy shit. Why are you assuming she was dropping a deuce in there? Look. Look. It's possible. It's a 50-50 chance, isn't it? But I really did just go to the restroom, not the basement, you know? Yeah, how do we know? Also, I don't think I was there long enough to be suspicious, right? How long were you there, Keo? You're the ultimate cosplayer, though. Oh, here, here we go with this. You could have just disguised yourself okay. as someone else while you so were So now out. we have to disprove this because they don't know about her condition, I guess. Disguised? No, no. I don't do disguises. You don't, huh? I don't think that's possible. And I know the reason why. Yeah, yeah, we saw it. Well, it's weird, but we saw it. Uh, intense shoulder pain, sudden stomach ache, cost pox. How do I do this? Same way as before. I get it. Got it. Oh, this is so cute. Sumugi can only cosplay as fictional characters. This really makes no sense, but we have to roll with it, don't we? That's what cosplay is supposed to be in the first place. Okay, I know. Don't Lately, be mad at me. Some people prefer to cosplay as non-fictional characters, which is unforgivable. Uh-huh. It's so unforgivable that I break out in cosplay if I even attempt it. I see. So yeah, it's like your nervous reaction. Pretty gross. Uh, okay. I see. If that's the case, then there's no way you could have been in disguise. All right. Sorry about that, Samugi. I just thought it was something to check. Oh, he even said sorry though. He's a nice guy, isn't he? Oh no, it's fine. I'm not bothered by it at all. Oh yeah. Oh, Samugi is so nice. She's way better than you. Careful, don't always trust the nice ones, though. We know that. Well, fuck you, too. <laughs> God. Getting back on topic, we now have alibis for the people in the dining hall. Right, right, okay. So we know that Kirumi, Samugi, Mew, and Kyo can't be the culprit. Right, okay. So what about the rest? Congratulations to the four of you. You can all leave now. No, they can't. Huh? Can they? Nope. They stuck here. With us. So what about the swines who went to the basement? They're all suspicious, right? Mm, not necessarily, because they were all together, too. Which of us went to the basement? Everyone except the people you just well, mentioned. Well, when Shuichi and I were on lookout, we saw... Here comes the, the picture again. <laughs> Kaito, Gonta, Maki, Tenko, Himiko, Angie, and Rantaro. So, seven people in total. Yep. So the culprit is among those seven? Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> but of course. Where did you get that from? Why are you laughing? That includes you too. It does. Excluding Rantara, one of the six people who headed to the basement. Right. Is the mastermind of this killing game? I don't know. Like I said, I, I have a bad feeling about this. I don't like how they're setting it up for just this linear answer. I'm not sure. The person who's making us endure all these terrible things? Why not torture the truth out of them? It would be the quickest method. While you're not wrong, I think we need to hold off on that for just a minute. I know you're very excited about it. Wait! Please! No torture! My tolerance for pain is actually really, really low. <laughs> Same. I'll tell you everything, anything. Just please don't hurt me. It's okay, Tenko. I don't think you did it. You're too good. Please just tell us what happened. Okay. If the culprit is among that group, then wouldn't Maki be the most suspicious? Why? Just look at her. What? She could definitely look, kill someone. Just because she looked like Shadow the Hedgehog don't mean nothing. Being so stupid. The culprit could easily be anyone, like Kaito. Yup. What are you talking about? <laughs> There's no way I'm the culprit. That's a Kazuichi face right there. Who's the culprit? Who? Oh, this is why we shouldn't have done this because now everyone's just shouting back and forth. Genta is gentlemen. Gentlemen not hurt people. No, we know you didn't do it, sweet boy. It's not me either. Yeah. 
Murder sounds like way too much. She's work. way too lazy. <laughs> I I I, I bet that. that. Do you, darling? Do you? Who's the culprit for fuck's sake? Oh God, this is this is getting us nowhere. We need to calm down. If everyone talks all at once, then we can't discuss anything. True, true. It's all right, Kaede. We just need to listen to everyone's statements. Good lord, that's gonna take forever. You can do this, right? All right, let's do it. Listen to everyone's statements? That's right. I can pick out everyone's voices as they talk over each other. I only went because I was invited. Why don't you ask the shady guy who invited me? Okay. Okay, Maki. What? You mean me? But I just said it wasn't me! Okay. Don't thrust the blame onto me! You degenerate males and your thrusting! Uh-oh, okay. I'm not a bad girl, really. If you don't believe me, ask my mommy. I'd love to, but she's not here. Where is she? I have an alibi! That's all you're saying! Where is oh, the culprit? culprit? Oh, God. Oh no, all three people are talking at once. What do I do? Help, this is crazy. This is like my most feared social situation in real life. <laughs> Everyone is clamoring to prove their innocence. There's a panic in the courtroom. Oh, that's right, it's time. You will now be thrown into a mass panic debate. During the mass panic debate, three debates will happen at the same time. Okay, let's look at this. So the time, the influence gauge is the same. There are weak spots in some of the things that they're saying. And we have the bullets, like usual, okay? It's just a three-part system. But remain calm, it's just like a non-stop debate. You're just hearing triple the opinion. Simple, right? Aim at the conversation you really want to hear and concentrate to listen more clearly. Oh, I see, okay. Sort through everyone's opinions, find the liar contradiction and refute it. You can also use V-Counter, so if you're confident, give that a shot. Sorry to take up your time. Thanks for being a sport about it. We love you, Tutorial John. I need you. Alright, let's see if I can do this. Mass panic debate start. God, this is gonna be weird. See if I'm Shuichi Library that oh, Whoa, whoa, oh my goodness me. Whoa. Oh my gosh, what am I supposed to do here? Well, nothing's Rentara come up yet. Rentara is the only one who Robot left in the middle of it. None of us there could have killed him. Wait, what's Maki's account? I need to read it over to make sure. Before the murder, seven people went to the game room in the basement. Rentaro, Maki, Kato, Tenko, Angie, Himiko, and Gonta. But Gonta had immediately locked himself in the aid room in the back. Rentaro left to go to the bathroom. After Kato and Tenko went to get Rentaro, the only people left in the game room when the murder happened were these three, Maki, Angie, and Himiko. Okay. Oh, okay. Then hang on. Didn't he just say? Okay, then that's what we have to hit right there, I think. All the different voices are confusing me, but Kaito's statement was suspicious, right? Okay, so they're leading us to it for this one to help us out. It'll be fine as long as I stay calm and listen for everyone's unique voice. Blimey, this is nuts! Good lord. What? Are you talking about me? Right. We're having a strategy meeting together. Remember? Having a strategy meeting together. Okay. I hear it. That's it then. Because that would be a lie. Wait a minute, Kaito. Wasn't there someone else who disappeared other than Rantaro? Yup. That idiot already forgot. Gonta also left during the strategy meeting. Right, right. Yeah, he locked himself up in the AV room and... Yup. Hey, wait a sec. Idiot! No. <laughs> it's a little late. Is that right, Gonta? Oh, no, poor Gonta. Y yes. Gonta watched Bug Movie to fill Gonta with fight Ugh. so Gonta can fight Monokuma. Oh, the sweet guy. Jeez. Were you trying to imagine yourself as a huge mantis with swords for hands? What, like Zora? Oh, come on! How is looking at bugs supposed to put you in a fighting mood? Don't worry about that. It's not your business. A terrible idea. Like putting ketchup on a hot dog. What? But why did you lock the door? Yeah, why did you lock the door? Because Gonta need focus. Oh. Hmm? Everyone oh. suspect Gonta. It's so hard why? to not like him. I just want to protect him. Because you don't have an alibi. 
Well, I mean, he was in the room, but he couldn't get out of the door. Oh. I'm assuming we're going to bring that up next. Alibi? Yeah, yeah. Tell okay. You. Gonta will get Alibi. Just tell Gonta where oh, to find it. Just sweet giant. The way this debate is going, this will be difficult to refute. Yeah. <laughs> what will you do? Without an alibi, we'll all choose you. Well, hang on. We've got to make sure we're doing the right thing or we're all going to get whacked. Gonta, please understand that in order to reveal the truth, you must also participate. Okay, she's trying to explain to him at least. Uh, Gonta not sure where to start. Just start at the beginning. You just have to tell everyone why you couldn't have done it. Yeah. If you're not the culprit and we all vote for you, yep. then we're dead too. That's very important. Sorry, I'm sipping my LaCroix. Our lives are riding on your word. You got this. Aw, he's so... He really is nice, isn't he? He's a nice okay. guy. Gonta will try. For everyone's sake. He's always, like, helping people out. Giving them the pep talk. Come on, Gonta, you can do it. <laughs> fight, Gonta! Fight! Fight! <laughs> God. Cut it out, you fucking bobblehead! Oh, all right. Everyone settle. This debate is getting loud and heated, but if I just focus on everyone's voice, then hopefully we can expose the mastermind. Is it panic again? Okay. Oh no, non-stop debate. Moving bookcase card reader, I'm gonna assume it's gonna be Gunter, the door this time. Culprit. Because we know that the sliding door is to it. Leave AV room. Gonta must walk through game room where friends are. That's true. To even reach hallway. Yep, but there is a door. If you can't get to the hallway, you can't go to the library. AV room's got more than one entrance, though. Yep. There should have been a door facing the hallway, too. There is. The sliding door across from the rear entrance. Oh, it's correct? not lit up. With that sliding door. Oh, here it is. I'm just gonna do it now, because I uh oh. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do it now because go in and out of the library. I'm just gonna miss it now because I knew that was it. Damn it! <sighs> I suck at this. I'm gonna blame the game on that one. Well, that's settled. Let's go home. Girl, we ain't got no home to go to. Gonta, not culprit. Well, now we get to see all of that. Could Gonta have gone to the library from the AV room without anyone noticing? No. Can he really have done it? No. Gonta, not culprit. <laughs> Yeah. All right. There should have been a door facing the hallway too. Let's see if we can do it this time. The I want to get those extra points, but maybe I shouldn't bother. Entrance, correct? Should I not bother? With that sliding door. Door. Did I get it? No, that's wrong. How could you tell if you got it? <sighs> I can't tell. They all look the same. Help me out with that, guys. It's not possible to use the sliding door. Yeah, yeah. Now we'll tell them. You saying I'm wrong? You got a lot of ass to be contradicting me. Uh huh. Did you mean to say sass? <laughs> I am. Um, think you left out an S. I think so as well. The sliding door always jams. You're only able to open it a crack. Okay, true. Yep, show him. The only part of your body that will be able to go through is your arm. And in Gonta's case, nothing because he's huge. And there was no indication of the door being forced. Yep. There was dust on the track. So he never tried to get out. In other words, the chance they came out the sliding door is zero. So he has an alibi. Uh, I see. So I made a mistake. How rare. Uh-huh. It's not that rare for you to make a mistake. Oh. Your entire existence is a mistake. Oh, dear. To be fair, she did call him an abortion earlier. I guess I'll let it slide. Vicious little... If Gonta couldn't use the sliding door, then in order to get to the library... Mm-hmm. He'd have to go through the game room, but I didn't see him at all. Well, then that's that, isn't it? See? Gonta tell you oh, he's not culprit. This little shiny noise. Oh, my goodness, I love no, him so much. We cannot confirm that just yet. Wait, why not? Eh? Huh? What's wrong, Kirimi? My apologies, Gonta. I do not mean to put you on the spot like this, but... But... Because I promise to do my best, oh. I will fulfill that responsibility. She's got, she's got something on her mind. What is it? Uh, are you saying Gonta could still be the culprit? Come on, nobody here believes There's that. There's the possibility that Gonta killed Rantaro from the AV room. What? How in the world? From the AV room? How? Oh, uh -huh. 
I didn't know that was a possibility. Well, let's 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 wait and hear what she's got first. Not only could he have killed Rantaro from the AV room, but also. But also. He would not appear in any of the pictures from the cameras placed in the library. Yeah, but am I missing something? Whoa! Perfect. But wait, then how did Gota kill him? Well, it's obvious to this glamorous girl genius. <laughs> but maybe she doesn't know. These <laughs> but I don't know either. So what is first, it? I will explain the layouts of both the AV room and the library. Okay. Please do. Right. The sliding door in the AV room faces the rear door of the library. Right. Because of this, it is possible for Gonta to have killed Rantara while he was in the AV room. With what? Um, but how though? Yeah. In order for the murder to take place, the rear door of the library must be opened. Okay. Uh, wait a sec. Isn't that impossible? I think so too. The AV room sliding door doesn't open, so you can't get into the hallway. Yeah, didn't we just say that? If you cannot enter the hallway, how would you open the rear door to the library? Mm-hmm. Although you cannot fit your whole body through the sliding door, wait a minute. An arm would suffice. Didn't they say though that you could get a thin arm through it? The Gonta's arm, have you seen it, woman? It's bigger it than you. Possible if you used a particular item in the AV room. A particular item? In the AV room? What was in there? Other than like a couch and a television and movies. What what what? Spot the selection. Well, the speakers won't fit. Are they are they talking about the t the screen or something? Really? Wait a minute. What nothing else here would fit. 10 seconds. Um I mean, I guess you could throw but it's just a projection screen. I get it. Is that really what they wanted me to pick? Is it the projector screen? Wait, please explain this because other th I, other than me guessing, I had no idea why. That is correct. You can make a long pole if you roll oh, up the screen. Oh, I see. Oh, come on, though, girl. Even with his strength, how's that gonna work? It would be possible to reach the library door with it. But then what? If you use the rolled-up screen to reach the library's rear door. Uh huh. Then you can open it. But you're gonna say that he lobbed a shot put ball through that and, and not only hit the target, but with enough force to kill him? You would need like an open space to do the that. The screen itself is quite heavy, but that would not have been a problem for Gonta. This is this is out there. Yeah, no problem for Gonta. Uh oh, sir. Oh my. How honest. Oh my goodness me, he's gonna get himself killed. No. But if you open the library door. The camera would take your picture. God, their voices are so low compared to this music. This happens every time. Uh, actually, the camera wouldn't be triggered just by opening the door. Okay. Shuichi and Kaede's pictures were like that as well. Yup. The shutter only went off once someone set foot into the room. That's right. Door opening wasn't enough. Okay. Okay, so it was possible to open the library door, but where does that get us? I don't know. Gonta still couldn't have gotten from the AV room to the library. Hmm. Gonta did not enter the library. He killed Rantara while he was still in the AV room. I... I applaud you trying to figure out everything, but this is very far-fetched. If Gonta killed Rantara in the library while he was still in the AV room, then... So does that mean... Going to through the shot put ball? Through that tiny crack with isn't a shot put ball bigger than an arm. Wait! Wait, I say! Why would anyone do something so crazy like throw a Wait! That's actually not uh, crazy at all! <laughs> I love this face. Throwing a shot put ball <laughs> is totally normal! Uh. Yes, the act of throwing a shot put ball could lead one to use it as a weapon. I just don't see the logistics of this, so look, I get it, it's possible, but very unlikely. Even if a person couldn't fit through the space, a shot put ball certainly would. I don't know, you'd have to have perfect trajectory in that small space for the shot put ball not to ricochet off that little opening. In my mind. Rentaro's body was across from the AV room sliding door as well. Wait a minute now, too. Wouldn't... Wasn't the bookcase also open in the pictures? 
Wouldn't that mean that that would be in the way too? Or are they not even considering that? He would have been able to hit the victim. They probably aren't even considering That's that point yet. The distance, though. Yeah, I don't, none of this is good. This is just time wasting, girl. And that shot put ball was pretty heavy. Well, that's not a problem. Right. Did you forget already? Gonta easily picked up the heavy manhole cover. That's right. It would definitely be feasible for him to throw a shot put ball at his target. This is just. Yep. A walking, talking Roomba can't compare to a mighty beast like Gonta. Oh man, like this is hard because you know already that this is gonna lead you down somewhere else, but you gotta sit that here and listen Roomba to it. That Roomba remark is probably not about me, because <laughs> I have a variety of custodial functions. Oh shit, really? Where you well, hide them Gonta, up? Can you throw a shot put ball from that distance? It's not the distance that's the problem, it's that tiny oh, opening. Yes, probably. Oh, Gonta, you poor baby. You're too honest, Gonta. It's true. You're so cool, Gonta. You could be the ultimate shot putter. <laughs> well, I've heard enough. Gonta's the culprit. Wait a minute now. Hang on. Wait. Gonta never hurt anyone. I believe Not even you. insect. I believe him. There's no way he's going to be. You know what? I'm saying it right now, and I don't care. You can call me out later, but I am betting to you right now that he's not murdering anyone. Gonta telling truth. Gentlemen, never tell lies. Now, I better be right about this. <laughs> I don't. I think that was a very, very risky bet to make. Well, there you have it. What do you guys think? I'm calling it now. He's not going to be a murderer ever. I'm not saying he won't be killed, but I'm saying he's not going to murder someone. Damn it! I would like to. Don't say a him, word. But without evidence, we cannot. Oh, come on, guys. What are we going to do? If everyone is wrong, we'll never find the mastermind. I can't let that happen. I need to do my best to guide everyone to the right answer. What do we got? <clears throat> Excuse me, debate? Okay. Makuma file. The moving bookcase has got to be it. So we agree. Gonta's the culprit. Because I just said that that's going to be in not the way. Culprit. Honest. A typical degenerate male excuse. Mm hmm. Rentaro's corpse in the AV room door. Yep. Do line up with one another. They do, but. There are no obstacles. Oh, girl. Don't lie. Oh, there we go. The V. No, that's wrong. I got it. Oh, I put that right through your shit. Break. It would have been impossible for Gonta to have thrown that shot from the AV room. That's right. Tell him. Because there was an obstacle between Rentaro and Gonta. That's right. Obstacle. Mm-hmm. The moving bookcase. When Rantaro was killed, it should have been open. It should have. Yup, that's our evidence. So we got the it. The bookcase door was open when he was killed. Great. Whoa, 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 uh, uh, hello? Select. What am I selecting? Oh my god. Uh, well, we've got a lot of time, so what the hell's happening here? Oh, oh, she's saying, okay. So the, the photos is what shows that. Is that what they want me to do? This was, there was, this was in one and two, but it didn't look like this. So it scared me a little. Do we have the the hidden door photos? This one right here. Moving the open bookcase. That's right, it. isn't it? Yeah, okay. I that layout was strange. It's I was like, wait a minute, what? Picture. Here, look. Yeah, yeah, that's the one. See, you can see it right behind These him before two he pictures died. These were taken by the camera facing the moving bookcase. Yup, yup. These photos were taken moments before Rantaro was killed. The bookcase door is completely open here, and then it closes automatically. Yup. So it's not possible. So by the time we entered the library, the door had already closed itself. That's right. Before Rantaro was killed, the bookcase door was open. Okay. Even if Gonta did throw the shot, it yep. would have hit the bookcase instead. Absolutely. Thank goodness for that. I see. Well, that pretty much shuts the book on that theory, then. <laughs> Get it? Never mind. <laughs> if that's true, then there's no possibility that Gonta is the culprit. That's what I've been trying to say. What? Oh, goodness. <laughs> what? Why are you making this so complicated? <laughs> Just be the culprit already. Come on, uh, Kokichi, did you forget what happens if we vote for the wrong person? Uh, sorry. Oh. I don't think you need to apologize. Yeah, I don't think so. 
Yeah, that's right. A man shouldn't apologize so easily. Whoa, that's not why. It's because he didn't do anything, not because he's a man. I be the one to apologize. I am sorry for accusing you, Gonta. Aw, Kirimi's so nice. No, Gonta understand. Because we gotta find Colbert. Oh, he's so blessed. Oh my god, what well an angel. Said. For a degenerate male, you're actually pretty reasonable. Ugh, even Tank. That was a compliment for her, I think. I hate this sentimental crap. You know what? Shut up. No one's talking to you. Why is that? It's nice when everyone gets along like this. Yeah, yeah. And it pisses you I off, which works for me. Or something. I can't stand people having a good time. Well, then we should just have more of a good time to piss him off. That's that what. He's too evil to feel ashamed for being evil. I see. We could learn a lot from him. <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm not actually taking notes. I'm placing bets on racehorses. Oh shit, really? I'm Jones of Relief. I need a raccoon tail to chase my dragon! Oh my god. Sir. The Gont is in the clear, but don't break out the confetti just yet. Why not? I wanted to. We're Do you have any? suspects now. On top of that, we still don't even know how Rantaro died. That's the problem. So we only know what the weapon is? How are we supposed to find the mastermind with that? Yeah, I don't know. Unless this is gonna turn into a, oh, he killed himself thing. But there's no way they would do that in the first one for here, would they? We know the murder weapon is the shot put ball. But where did the culprit get like, it? There's, th really, there's no way, is there? God, I hope I not. I think it was from the warehouse. I saw track and field equipment there. It definitely from the warehouse, yes. Then anyone would have been able to obtain it. We need more information. We do. What are we gonna do? Hmm. What's wrong, Shuichi? Shuichi, you got something. Huh? Uh, uh, it's nothing. No, 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 don't say nothing now. Like, we need everything. Even, like, way out there ideas. Shit, we've already had some way out there ideas. Shuichi, you got something, don't you? Ah! How do we find this darn culprit now? Shuichi, you gotta say something. Hey, culprit! Quit hiding! Just be a man and fess Guys, up I'm already! Nervous. I'm nervous. What if Shuichi's not saying anything because he knows something? What if it's... What if it's the bad feeling I had before? We don't even know if they're a guy or not though, right? About him being gone so long. Mm -mm. Or if they're even human. If they pull that on me in this first trial, I swear to God. Are you referring to me? Oh, poor Kibo. Don't worry, you guys. We're one step closer to the truth, so don't give up. Right, if we eliminate every possibility, then surely we'll get there to the truth. Try to remember what happened. We can find more clues left by the mastermind. We've got to be able to do this. Clues? What kind of clues? Oh, brother. Like, hmm. if Rantaro was deceived by the mastermind and went to the library. Right. Maybe somebody saw Rantaro having a suspicious conversation with someone. Did anyone see that? Well, maybe even someone saw it like a day before, like anything at this point. It would be a good idea to figure out who knew about our trap. Either way, anything you guys remember might be able to help with the case. Anything at this point, because we've really, have we hit the wall already? Yes, yes, but are you sure this. the culprit is also the mastermind? This, this is what I'm worried about. I don't think so. I don't think so. It's too soon. Well... I guess you can't even really say that, but my my gut instinct is telling me that she's right. Huh? Yeah, I think so. Why? I don't think so, though. Then what Atua just told me about how the culprit entered the library is correct! What you mean? Huh? I didn't hear anything. What, what did Atua tell you? Go ahead and tell us. Oh, that's right. Only I can hear the voice of Atua. <laughs> she's so cute. Then I will speak on Atua's behalf. As his prophet. Okay, go for it, honey. Do the you. The culprit is the mastermind. They could have entered the library while avoiding the cameras. Yeah? What? Are you serious? There's a way to do that? Is there a way to do that? Super serious, brother. <laughs> You're a two. It sounds like a shady weirdo. Well, well, let's not worry about that now. A way for the culprit to enter the library without being caught by the cameras. Is that really possible? Atua says... I should continue explaining on his behalf. Okay, sweetheart, you do it. Honestly, I'll take anything at this point. Yeah, ha, ha, ha. Only 
Katua knows the truth behind this incident! Are we going with this? I guess we are. <laughs> Alright, non-stop debate. What do we have? Card reader, dust, library, vent. We probably don't need the Maki's account anymore or the photos. In the library the whole time. Okay. Before Kaede and Shuichi even placed the cameras. Oh. Where would they have hidden? Inside the hidden door. Wait, no. So you're saying the culprit was lying in wait there? Oh, we already have a counter for if that. That's true. It's it's the 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 right here. It's the dust. We saw that it hadn't been moved. Were alone at so the she's time saying the that they probably put the door forward the Maybe other way and came out of the door. But we know that that didn't happen. Okay. Kichi and Kibo and Ryoma, right? Oh, okay. I want to see all of it. I knew the culprit was a male. Oh. Behold, Atua's divine logic. Oh, look at she's so cute. Weird, but cute. I've never had to debate a god before. I can't tell there's a contradiction, but I don't think Angie's noticed it yet. The there is. was hiding in the library the whole time. All right, we're gonna get her. Before Kaede and Shuichi even placed the cameras. Where would they have hidden? In the hidden door. Inside the hidden door. There we go. No, that's wrong. It is wrong, unfortunately, darling. Break. Wait a minute, Angie. I don't think it was possible to hide in the hidden door. Yeah, tell her. What? You dare challenge Atua? We have to. I don't think the hidden door was ever used. Except for Rontaro pushing it outward, yeah. Huh? The dust is still there. It looks like the card reader wasn't used. That means the mastermind didn't hide here. While investigating the mastermind, I placed dust on the card reader. Right. Sorry, that was me taking a sip. With these long recordings, I need to have a little if drink. Anyone swipe their card key. Sorry, guys. The dust would have fallen. That's right. We already confirmed during the investigation that there was no dust on the floor. Yep, they looked. So that's the out. The bookcase hadn't been opened, so I doubt anyone was hiding in there. However, is it possible that anyone could have been hiding anywhere else? The fog has lifted. Whoa, whoa, what's wrong, boy? What happened? Realme, you don't believe me. Oh, with this again. Still got a ways to go. Oh shit, I am not good at these. You guys saw how I fucked these up in two. Oh no. Um. Okay, is this a rebuttal? Huh? What, what do you mean? I think it is. The culprit could have been in the library before the cameras. I agree, set. that is possible, but. You won't be able to prove anything with weak reasoning like that. But wasn't everyone accounted for? Like, when the time happened? I know some people left, but we had already, like... No one could have been hiding there the entire time because everyone was accounted for at some point as the announcement was made. Right? It seems you've been contradicted. When this kind of argument surfaces, you will go into a one-on-one -on -one debate called Rebuttal Showdown. What's a rebuttal showdown? For now, let's explain the controls. In this mode, you counter the other person's claim and argue against it. Alright, so is it the same? The blade, the time, the gauge, the mood, the true cylinder, and the bullet. Right, right? I'm, I was really bad at this in two. Move your truth blade with movements with the mouse and align it with your opponent's claims. Left click to perform a regular cut in the direction the blade is pointing. Right click to cut with a truth blade. Wait, so left click just to cut it away and then the truth bullet is the right one, okay. Oh sorry, I forgot to tell you. In this mode, truth bullets will be called truth blades. Use regular cuts on your opponent's words, but when a weak spot appears, slash it where the truth blades strike. Of course, if you don't have the correct truth blade, you will not be able to cut an opponent's remark. What's neat is if you cut through multiple words at once, you get a time bonus. Two at a time gets you two seconds. Three is three. The more you can cut down together, the better. I'm I'm warning you now that I'm terrible at this. I was bad at this before. Watch the position of your opponent's claims closely and slice as many as you can. By doing that, you can skew the debate's mood by to your advantage. When the mood of the argument is in your favor, the debate will progress. On the other hand, if you ignore the other person's remarks, it will skew towards their advantage. And then you'll have to deal with a loss of progress. Well, that, that's gonna happen. If you and your opponent's arguments are even, a blade lock will occur. When that happens, left click as fast as you can to push them off. 
Isn't slicing and dicing opinions with a true sword the bee's knees? What, not really? Well, you shouldn't knock it before you try it. You can also V agree so if we blah blah blah. Thanks for your time. I probably won't be going for the V's and these because, like I said, this gave me trouble in two. Let's see how it works here. Alright, it's time for the bottle. God, I hope I can do this right. Monokuma file, Rantara's belonging, French Even entrance photos, rare entrance door, photos. The library's got no shortage of hiding spots. Oh, shoot. Oh, I see. There's piles of books all over. Since the culprit was there before Ooh. the cameras were, it could have been hiding there. What do I want? Know? It's probably one of the photos, right? They took out Rantaro, then took off. Advance? What? I see if now. If the culprit killed him and ran away, wouldn't they have been caught on camera? Yeah. Not if they went back into hiding. Hmm. Right after killing Rantaro. Then, once everyone's gathered around the body, all they okay. gotta do is act like they just ran in. Oh, I see, I see. Rejoin everyone and we'd be none Oh, rejoin one. everyone! I'll cut your words! They, no, because then they wouldn't be there. Right? That's what I just said. I hope I was right on that. The I guess I was. met him inside the library? Yeah, 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 yeah. That doesn't seem possible. This is what though. I just said. I did that on impulse. I'm glad I was right. The first yellow thing that popped up. See, I did this in two as well, and then I got fucked for it a lot of the time. I got burned. Let's hear it then. What's your reason? I got lucky on this one. But I think I'm right. If you take a look at the three pictures from the camera we placed near the front door. Yup. This is when Shuichi and I met up with Kaito and Tenko, and then rushed in. That's right. This one shows the other four people running in after they heard Tenko scream. That's right. Don't we have basically everybody? Yeah, and we finally, do. And finally, everyone else coming in after hearing the body We have everyone on these photos, except for Antara. You can clearly see everyone entering the library in these pictures. So there wouldn't be a way for them to get out. It wouldn't make sense if there was someone hiding in the library the whole time. That's right. Well, that does cover everyone now, doesn't it? It does. I'm sorry. Man, this is a long... We've been going for a long time. Is there going to be a break? People said to wait for the break. I guess the one who still has a ways to go is me. Oh, she is okay. It's okay, because you don't- you feel bad when you make a mistake, so then it's fine. It's all forgiven. Don't worry about it. It's better to think about each possibility anyway. That's right, that's true. Right, Shuichi? Yeah. Oh, something- no. Hmm? Uh, I don't um, like yes. this. I don't like this. Something's wrong here. Is Shuichi okay? He's been really quiet. Is he worried about something? So the real question is how the culprit mm -mm. entered and exited the library. I don't like this. I don't like this. We cannot continue until we address that problem first. True. It's quite the mystery. How did the killer avoid being caught by the cameras? I'm worried about this. It's either one of two things. It's either one of two things. Either he killed himself, which I really hope they wouldn't do in the first trial. Or I think it has something to do with Shuichi and possibly Kaede's plan. Mm -mm. Almost like they were invisible. I don't like this. Oh, but it wasn't me. My magic can only make you half invisible. Okay, <laughs> I believe you. Your upper half, to be specific. Why just that? What? That's kind of a half-baked invisibility spell, isn't it? A little bit. But both doors to library had hidden cameras on them. That's right. How about the vent in the library? I knew that Maybe we would get to the vent. There. Yeah, yeah. And that's what I'm actually worried about now. Even though we stacked the books, was that like the only failsafe we had? But Shuichi and I were on lookout in the classroom with the connecting vent. Right. The culprit waited until Kaede and Shuichi weren't looking, then turned invisible. Uh-huh. Himiko is really gung-ho about her invisible culprit theory. Uh, really? <laughs> Um, yeah, no. There's no way someone snuck into the library through the vent. Yeah, true. That's right. We have evidence that proves that would have been impossible. The books. I don't... I guess it is impossible, but they were still the way they were, so that's what we're going with. I get it. Okay. So it's, yeah, the books. When I set the cameras, I also stacked some books in front of the vent. Right, right. If someone did crawl in and out from the vent, the books would have collapsed. 
True. While we were investigating, they were still neatly stacked the way I placed them. While we were investigating, they were still neatly stacked the way I placed them. <gasps> oh no! Wait a minute. No, that can't be it. If it went through there, the books would have still been messed up, right? Oh no. I just had a sickening thought. Should I tell it to you? The, the shot put ball hit him on the head. What if it came through there? But wait a minute, that would mean a whole bunch of shit if it did. A whole bunch Maybe of shit. Maybe they put the books back when they left the room. Oh no. That would be quite difficult to achieve on such a narrow bookcase. Yeah, 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 uh huh. If uh -oh. we ruled out the vent and doors, then how'd the culprits get in and out of the library? That would make kind of sense. No one would have had to have been in the library to make that happen. Divine intervention? I don't think so, dear. Gonta no can think of any other way to enter. Eureka! I know how the culprit got in the library. What? The front door! What are you talking about, girl? Um, have you been paying attention? <laughs> the camera would have taken their picture. Not if the culprit timed their movements around the camera intervals. What? Huh? Intervals? You can do that? What is that? Tell us, Mia. Basically, the culprit knew about the cameras and their intervals. Okay. Shutter so speed? They snuck into the library between camera shots. Oh, I guess. To avoid appearing in the photos. If it is only a box digital camera, it can't take like multiple photos, bang, 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 at once like that. It just doesn't have that technology to do it. <laughs> is that what she's saying? I know, I know. Beauty <laughs> and brains. Why? It's just not fair. It's truly. New? What's this interval you're talking about? Explain it. Huh? Oh, now you're asking me. After the shutter snaps, the camera can't take a new photo for 30 seconds. I see, of course. Because I redesigned the cameras to auto-roll the film instead of having to do it manually. Right, right, because you usually have to wind those things. That's the first time I'm hearing about this. Why didn't you tell us from the start? Why didn't you? <laughs> oh. <laughs> but, but I told your little beta boy toy after I gave you the remodeled camera. Shuichi. What? You didn't tell her? Uh uh uh. Sh I Shuichi? I don't like this. No. Uh, I, I'm, I'm sorry. Oh no. I I guess I forgot to tell you. No. How could you forget to tell me? Oh no, 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 no. I don't like this. I didn't think it would affect the plan. No, you would never I, do that. I didn't realize it would matter. What do you mean? You're the ultimate detective. You're lying. I guess I just forgot to mention it. I'm really sorry. You're lying, Shuichi. <laughs> I forgot. What a pitiful excuse. Oh no. Yeah, that's pretty much a lie. Yeah, I agree. N no, it's not a lie. Oh, okay. He probably just forgot. No, you're too trusting, and so am I. There was so much going on <laughs> at the time. It's only natural to forget, you know? Tell me he's not the culprit. Yeah. And it would make sense, too, if he was, right? Think about it. Let's put that aside for now and talk about the camera intervals. They paired you up with him immediately to fall in love with him. Each interval lasted for 30 seconds. Oh, I feel sick. You? Yeah, sure. I'll explain it again to you mushheads. Yeah, yeah. The three cameras that Kai Idiot and Puichi placed go <laughs> off when they pick up movement. Right. From there, it takes 30 seconds for the film to auto-roll to the next photo. Okay. So, for 30 seconds, anyone could have entered the library without their photo being taken? Uh-oh, that's bad. That may have been enough time to kill Rantaro and exit the library. It's definitely enough time! You just gotta move at lightning speed! Okay, so who's gonna do that? I see, I see! Then there's no doubt the culprit made use of the camera's intervals! Hmm... That means the culprit was Mew all along, since she knew about the intervals. Right. Don't be an asshole! I have an alibi. Remember the dining hall? Yeah, she was there. Oh, yeah. So it's not her. Well, <laughs> who else knew about the intervals? Shuichi. 
Hmm. Now, who was it again? Oh, dear. Shirichi. Yep. Uh-uh. <laughs> well, then, does this mean that he is the culprit we have been seeking? I don't know. Shuichi. Uh-uh. Hey, what gives, Shuichi? Oh, no, please don't do this. Shuichi would never do that. Right, Shuichi? I want to believe, too. I have to believe you wouldn't, right? You would better speak soon. Your oh. silence only damns you further. Stop being so hot, you're distracting. Mess up already! Did you kill Rantaro? Shuichi, what's wrong? Oh my goodness. Hey, Shuichi, what's gotten into you? This is this is bad. Don't tell me you're gonna plead the fifth now. <laughs> oh man, this is getting good. Oh boy. Entertain me, peasants. When do we get this break that I so sorely need? Because I gotta think. No way. Shuichi can't be the culprit. That's definitely wrong. There's no way. I refuse to believe Shuichi's the culprit. That's definitely not possible. <gasps> okay, thank god. Oh my god! Oh my- Ugh! Alright. Okay. Okay, I'm going to put this entire thing up as a test. So many of you wanted me to do this. So I'll know that if you guys watch the entire video and like it, I will keep doing the trials until the break. And then the next part of it as one as well. But I'm worried because a lot of people don't usually watch videos that are this long. So don't let me down. If you want to watch the whole thing, please watch the whole thing so I can see it. And make sure that it's getting watched enough and... uh then I won't have to split these up like I think I might have to. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you in the next one. No spoilers, but thanks for your tips and tricks. We're in this together now. It's too late to go back. Toodaloo.